This presentation will be on how to create a photo story, or to a more general degree, any type of image-based story. In this case, it will be a playoff of my own literacy story. First of all, there are a number of ways you can go about making a photo story. In this case, we'll be using Windows Movie Maker. This is a proprietary software that comes with Windows, but there are other equivalents if you are using a Mac or Linux-based operating system. Depending on how your computer is set up, your Windows Movie Maker could be in different places. Typically, photo stories incorporate images to help illustrate the plot of the story. In this case, I used a mixture of scanned images from my scanner and some images taken directly from my camera. For myself, I had images laid out on my desktop. You might have them in a folder. All you do is click and drag your mouse over the group of photos that you want to import and drag them into the collections box in Windows Movie Maker. At this point, you'll have all of your photos ready to work with. Depending on how you want to narrate your photos, you can drag your pictures from the pool of photos onto the timeline in a specific order. For this case, I want to drag my photos according to my literacy story timeline. Now that you have all of your photos in place, what's left to do is to narrate your story since no story is complete without the story itself. On the toolbar above the timeline, there is a picture of a mic. Click that to start the recording process. You'll notice a new display comes up in place of your photos. Click Start Narration. Go through your narration and once you finish, click Stop Narration and save your file. Now your narration is in place. Adjust your images to fit the timing of your narration. At this point, to your left, you can introduce different fade-ins or fade-outs effects for your images, so take some time and pick what you like. Once you finish adding effects, you can proceed to saving and finalizing your video by clicking Save to my computer. Enter a name for your new video, follow the on-screen prompts, and congratulations, you've just made a photo story. By the way, this was made with Windows Movie Maker.